Welcome to our lecture online. In this video and the ones to come, we're going to talk about second order circuits. So what are second order circuits? Well, we've drawn a few diagrams of what they might look like. Notice they either have a voltage source or a current source. They do all have a resistor in them and they do have at least two what we call energy saving devices or storing devices. We have inductors and capacitors and if there's two of them in a, in a circuit, it could be that they're both inductors or both capacitors or one of each. It could be that it's in a series circuit or a parallel circuit, it doesn't matter. Those are called second order circuits. The reason for that is when you start summing up the voltages around any of the loops inside the circuits, you will end up with a second order differential equation. And so that's what sets it apart from first order equations because those only have one energy storing device. So that's what the difference is between first order and second order. And now we'll show you mathematically how to, of course, calculate all the various aspects of second order equations or second order circuits. And that's how it's done. 